Hi, welcome back to my channel. It is Taylor here, obviously. You are on my channel. So today I'm just gonna be doing a little vlog, a little cook with me Sunday vlog kind of thing. We went to church this morning. It's terrible nasty weather outside, otherwise I'd hang out with the puppies outside. I'm gonna show you guys um, how gross it is here. So if you're not familiar with the Pacific Northwest, it does truly rain all the time. Like people ask, does it actually rain all the time? Yes, it does. Not in the summer, obviously. It's really, well, that's not even guaranteed, but it is beautiful in the summer here but let me show you what it's like literally the rest of the year. Just like this, just like this. It's actually raining right now, but you can't even really see it. You can see it on the windows there, but it's, uh, it's just like this all the time for the next six months. I am not a cook at all. Don't like it. I am not one of those girls that like looks forward to cooking. I don't enjoy it. It's not my thing. Every once in a while, like I do like it every once in a while, just as a rare occurrence. So actually in our household, Garrett is more of the cook because he likes cooking. And you know, I think people should just do what they like doing and what their strengths are. For me, it's not that. So I actually don't mind uh, cleaning. So usually Garrett will cook um, dinner and I will clean up after dinner just because we're both happy, we're both doing what we don't mind doing, and yeah, that's just how it works. But I do have the Magnolia Table recipe book. I don't know, I think she's a couple now, but this is the one that I'm gonna be using. I've never made a recipe out of there, but we're having my family for dinner here tonight for the first time in our new house. So I was like, all right, let's just, let's get this done, let's do a recipe. I picked a really easy like enchilada recipe. Anyway, I was telling Garrett yesterday that I was gonna make enchiladas tonight, and he's like, do you know how to make enchiladas? I'm like, I know how to follow a recipe. I couldn't make them by heart, but I can read some instructions, so yeah. So I do need to go to the store to get some more ingredients. Um, we have like probably half the stuff here, but do still need like quite a bit of stuff. So really dreading going outside in this weather um, to go to the store, but it's gonna be pretty quick. It's currently 3.30 and my family will be here in a few hours, so I better go get the food and then, excuse me, I can start making it. <laughs> So I just got back home and I already had like probably half of the ingredients. I just had to get the rest of them. So I'll show you guys what I got, um, but also I have the rest of everything in the fridge and I don't feel like pulling everything out. But I will share a screenshot of the recipe here so that you guys can take a picture of that if you guys wanna try it. Um, it's from the Magnolia cookbook that I just showed you guys. Anyway, so first things first, we got these restaurant style corn tortilla chips that I'm gonna heat up with um, some salsa as obviously the starter because Mexican, you need to have that for Mexican food. And then some corn tortillas, obviously. And I got two packs of those because I'm not really sure how much food I need to make because we're feeding um, six people. So I'd rather have too much than not enough. And one big tomato, I should have probably gotten two, but We'll see, this was a bigger one, so I'm hoping that it'll last for all of us. I got some lime, and the recipe called for lime, but also, Dos Equis. So, Garrett and my dad like these. I actually can drink these too. I'm not sure if I'll have one tonight or not, but um, these with lime are delightful. Six lime. Got some fresh cilantro here, and I got two cans of cream of chicken. Um, two cans of the diced green chilies. Like this. And a big thing of green enchilada sauce. This should be plenty, I hope. A big thing of mozzarella cheese, which I believe we already have mozzarella cheese, so we'll probably have extra. Um, but yeah, lots of that. And then we also already have sour cream, but I just got an, a little thing of it just to make sure that we had enough. And then obviously we have chicken and we have a couple of the other things that it calls for. So um, yeah, they won't be here for another couple hours, but I'm really excited to make this. It's supposed to only take 30 minutes or so, maybe 20 minutes of prep time and 30 minutes to make it. So I probably will put everything away for now. Um, I'm gonna start cleaning up the house a little bit just so it's more presentable. And we haven't even eaten at our table yet. Look at how messy it is. 
We just have been stacking things on top of there since we moved in basically so I'm not really gonna be able to put things away away But I will get things off the table so that we can actually eat there tonight and just clean up the kitchen and living room Well, we're, we're, where we will be hanging out tonight also super excited Yellowstone new season comes out tonight. So very excited about that. Uh, the rest of my family hasn't seen it So otherwise we would totally watch that tonight, but they haven't seen it So we're just gonna record it and then when they leave we're gonna watch it, but we are so excited We're big Yellowstone fans. So that's it. Got to clean now
about to watch Yellowstone. Dinner was so good. This is all that's left. You guys ready to go? Do you wanna go upstairs? Let's go, come on. Will you grab our blankets though? Yes. Okay, come on doggies. Yeah. Or just one, we could probably share the gray one too. Yeah. Upstairs, when you go. Will you grab me one too, please? Yeah. Hallie Finn, ah! Knock it off, thank ah. you. Knock it off. Thank yeah. you. I'm recording you, don't do anything weird. Okay. <laughs> Step one, turn on the projector. <laughs> Step two, turn on the receiver. Step three, turn on the Xbox. Holly, go lay down. <clears throat> go. That'd be cool. Step five, pet Finny Gillis. No. Finny Gillis. Oh, you look so cute. I know. We love you, Bubba's. The cutest Bubba in the world. Oh my oh. gosh, you are so cute. And Sally's cozy over there. <coughs> Ooh, is that Whoa. the spot? Got the spot. Oh, mama, that's the spot. <laughs> as cozy as can be. <laughs> Woo!